We are out nice and early. Me and Aisha are having a cute sausage day today. We're having um, a prep this morning. Yes, we are. We've come to prep. Well, I actually had to go to the doctor's this morning, so that's why we're up earlier. Are you going to fill them in before uh, your toe? My toe. <laughs> Basically, I, this is so gross, but I thought I had it in grown. It's not gross. People get it. I thought I had it in grown toe now, so I was messing with it. Turns out I may have not had one. I don't know, but you know when the side of your foot, like your toe hurts? I had that, so I was like messing with it. We had them it. growing up, don't we, both of us? Yeah, we've both had it. We had surgery on our toe, both of us. I haven't had surgery oh, on I've my toe. Oh, I've had surgery on my toe. Have you had surgery on your toe? I've had surgery on my toe. Oh, I didn't know that. Oh, oh wow, no, yeah. I've never. A little mini one, and it was a trainee, and they kept doing it wrong, so someone had to take over, and I was oh, in agony. Oh, I should know, I've months. never had ingrained toe, and I was really Oh, I had before. one when I was younger. I just, and yeah. I had surgery, I never had it. Oh, so I just had it before. Saying surgery, oh my god, it wasn't that <laughs> dramatic, but it was surgery. Yeah. Um, so I thought I had one, so I was messing with it, and I don't know, I may have got it out, because it was just hurting on the side, you know, at the top corner. Yeah, uh, I've now infected my toe, because I'm so silly. So I have to take antibiotics now, four times a day. So it's so my own fault for messing with it, yeah. Don't mess with your toe. Don't mess with your toe if you've got any grain toe love. Just go to the doctors. Anyways, so we've just been to the doctors, we've come to prep. I fancied porridge and I also got some honey. And I'm going to add some brown sugar. So it's going from healthy to unhealthy. <laughs> brown sugar? Yeah, because sugar, you know? And I thought, oh, I'll go brown sugar. I don't think you'll need the sugar once you pop the honey in. Yeah, we'll see. I've just got really sweet too. Um, and I just you got never some used water. to. No, I'm more of a savoury girl usually, but I just fancied porridge and then really sweet porridge. What have you got? So, I it was. I'm always thirsty. Pregnancy makes me literally like. God, I was literally water. the same, I remember. And in my last pregnancy, I, I was the same, but I always like fancied fruit, like fresh fruit normally, like apples, strawberries and stuff. So I picked up some fruit, and then I fancied like an oat bar or something like that. So it was, it was the um, the oat fruit and nut one. I think I've had it once before and didn't like it. <laughs> so I went for it again. <laughs> I think I'll like Pregnancy it. changes your, t your taste buds though, don't they? I just fancy something oaty. Like, I'm really into like oats. So I don't mm. like porridge though. Let me see what my porridge looks like. Porridge looks nice. You know when you've got like a warm mouth? I don't know if that sounds gross. I've but then the cozy vibes. You usually don't want like, I don't want warm it's my new H&M cardigan. I love it. It was only 19 I'll link yeah. it down below. So nice. I have it in like the purpley brown shade, which yeah. is also nice. We'll link that one as well. Oh, nice and thick. Look at that. So do you want to stir it? I'm going to put my honey in. Oh. Ooh. Did I really need to? Probably not. That's a lot. I don't think you'll want the sugar, you know. Do you not think? We'll see how you feel. I'll just do one for now. <laughs> this looks like good porridge. I will say, it's really good porridge in Costa. Costa. Yeah. The Marks and Spencer's one. I had it with mum the other day. It, yummy. It was so good. So good. Right, we're just going to have a little catch up on today's plans and yummy. Mm -hmm. Do you need the sugar? Probably not. Told you. Um, yeah, today's plans and our schedule. And I guess we'll see you guys in the first. I want to look at some candles. Candles? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we can do. We're Where excited. Do, do some full shopping. Homeware shopping. Yeah, homeware shopping. We were literally just talking about um, our labours and stuff, and I was saying to Celia, I literally remember, so I was induced, if you didn't know, and I remember, I think I was in the hospital all in all for like seven days. It was very long. I mean, other people's might be longer, but for me, I was like, God. See, mine was, I went in the day before and had her the day after. But I went the day before in the morning. Yeah. So I was there the whole day, and then the day after I had her in the morning. Lucky. Yeah. Well, I had a longer experience, so. And I don't know late. What, I don't know what this time is going to be. Yeah, I saw that my due date was meant to be the 14th, and I had her on the 16th. 16th. Yeah. So, See, my due that. date was the 7th, and I had her on the 4th. I was actually meant to have her earlier, but the yeah. induction took too long. Yeah. But anyways, and I remember laying there, and Jack said to me, I'm just going to have a nap, and he had his headphones in. I said, that's fine, yeah, he was sitting beside me. And I laid on my side, and I was just, I think I was watching a YouTube video or something like that. 
and I remember all of a sudden just getting like a big gush of like water come out and I was like Jack, Jack my water's a break, my water's a break. He couldn't hear me obviously, he was sleeping and had headphones in and I like knocked him with the pillow and I was like oh my god. Contraction started literally from zero to hundred. Yeah. I was like ah oh, my stomach. How long after was you allowed the epidural? No, and then they went you're lying. <laughs> went, no. You're lying. I was like, no. Really? I went back. Yeah. With me, I had like not similar, but it's like similar because Ben wasn't there. Ben literally got sent home because the visiting hours were done and he had to go home. And I was like, oh, I'm scared. And Ben was like, nothing will happen. You'll be fine. I'll be back here in the morning. Literally a few hours after he left. I was laying in the bed on my own with other women on the same ward as me. It was in the yeah. evening, so it was That's, really that quiet. That was me too, yeah. And then all of a sudden, I was wearing one of those nappy things. Mm. All of a sudden, gush. And then my whole nappy went... <laughs> was you just... standing? No, I was laying oh. down. I was like, I was texting you, you remember? Yeah, you went, I literally texting you just after the... You know you were FaceTiming me. No, I wasn't on FaceTime to you at that point. No, you went, I've got to go, I've got to go. You did, you were FaceTiming. I thought I was like, having mm -hmm. contractions oh, when I... It was one of them. It's because I called you and was like, I share my waters have broke, yeah. Mm -hmm. And I went because it was the contractions. And I was like, oh my God, my waters have just broke. And then I went to the lady and I was like, I think my waters have just broke. She was like, are you sure? And I was like, I can show you my nappy if you want. <laughs> it was like... And then literally, zero to a hundred, I was in agony and I felt so sorry for all the ladies because I was crying, I was in a lot of pain and I was like, please can my boyfriend come back, please, please, I don't want to be on my own. I was hugging the midwife and everything. I was. Like, I know, you literally love your midwife. Yeah, I know, she was lovely, I, I loved her so much. I remember much. crying to And I was like, can you, can you see if you can help me, can you go and see if I can have the epidural and she'll go, well, no, but don't go though, I don't want to be on my own because I was on my own. I was Petrified. I didn't know what was going to happen, obviously, because I didn't know what to expect. And then, yeah, Wait, I got to go to the labour ward when I was five centimetres. Oh, I. And I weren't in pain at five centimetres. I should, I was in agony. I had to go because I'm basically when you're waiting in Norwich, when you're waiting um, to go in labour, if you're early, you go to another ward. Okay. So I was in this pre ward. I was where in that, but yeah, that's yeah. where I was. So then, at five I, centimetres, I was allowed yeah, to go. Yeah, I can't remember what centimetres I was, but uh, to me, I felt like I was about to pop out the baby. But it wait, it calmed down a bit after because of the epidural, but. Literally, I had to walk from one side of the school to not the other side, but like to another part of the um, mm. place. And I remember going, "Come on, we've got to go really quick, quick, because I really don't feel well." And then Ben met just as I was leaving that thing. I was like, "You need to get Ben because he was asleep, deep sleeper." Thank God Rachel was there, his mum. So I was like, "You need to wake up Ben ASAP. My waters have just broke." And then Ben <laughs> said, "He shut up," and he was like. And he said afterwards, he remembers going to the car, like smiling, like, mm, it's all happening. Aww. I was like, that's so cute. <laughs> and then when he came, obviously he saw me, you know, when I had bad periods, he thought, oh God, God, I've seen there all this before. <laughs> I was in agony, but that's kind of what it felt like, my bad periods. You know, we, mm. I said I wanted to know. Yeah. It was very similar. Mm. And then I was giving me gas and air. Same. And I was like, this is not doing anything. It's not doing anything. I thought, just stay still. My epidural, epidural didn't work. My epidural away. worked very quickly. No, I, I literally was crying to the man who does it I can't remember really? what they're called and I begged did him you, to give me more did you have the top up thing like the top up did you press the button thing? yeah I don't remember yeah. if I did or if I've seen I did. people have that I had it where you oh press you press it, it when it runs out yeah when you keep pressing yeah, it yeah you press it and you can keep topping it up and then there's like a thing where you can top up a little bit more if you want to yeah 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 that's what I had but it wasn't strong enough so he had to give me oh. one. And he went, this is the last bit I'm giving you. I was like, thank you so much, thank you so much. Wow. But he was like, I was literally like so grateful. Wow. But then they did loads of other stuff on me and numbed me Did you have the hormone out. drip? No. I, I had the hormone drip. So when you had the hormone drip, it really like speeds things up. Oh, I didn't. Yeah, because Mine must have just that. went naturally yeah. because of all the other things they I guess put that, in yeah, because you, you were induced yeah. and everything. That's probably why mine went so quick then. Oh God, we've, we're doing too much of a, this talk for this yeah. kind of video. No, it's Sorry, fine, guys. it's fine. It's fine. Like, we just... <laughs> Because we just sat here talking, I was like, oh my god, let's film it. I want to know all your, if you guys have had a baby, right? Long story it short. It honestly makes me nervous for my next one. Yeah. This one. Nah, be excited. I loved the whole, afterwards, I was like, oh, even though I was, I had quite a traumatic birth. Mm. Maybe I'm saying that because I'm not pregnant right now, but I'm like, oh, I'll do it all again. But I think maybe when I get pregnant again. I was like that. And now because I'm in it again, I'm like, you, your nerves do kick in again. Because this time around, you kind of, in a way, you do know what to expect. But I've forgotten what the pain feels like. All I remember thinking is, I, I feel like I'm dying. <laughs> 
Yeah. It's, this is what I, I want. I will say though, Ash, from feeling like that to have an epidural, it's really quick. I had... Mine felt like it was out. But, but my epidural didn't work, yeah, so didn't. mine hurt my back. And do you know what? This pregnancy, I've been having a lot of back pain in the same area where my yeah. pain was when I was in labour. But I am scared though, because obviously, like, because I bled a lot, I lost a lot of blood. What if that happens again? They'll the know this time. Place, they'll know this time. Again. No, they'll know this time, and you Does might that not. Make sense? Yeah, but we both had forceps delivery, but you might not need that this time. Apparently, with your second baby, but I think it's the forceps out. delivery mostly because we had the epidural, so we couldn't actually feel what we was doing. Maybe but I think that did contribute to me having to have forceps. Had you to. probably pushed too hard. She told me not to push too hard and listen to her. See, I was going. <laughs> Ooh, get it out. No, see, because I thought push hard as you can. Get it out. Get it out. Because then you. To be honest, I couldn't push. even feel myself pushing. I, the reason she was like push from your bum, like you have a That's what I did. Really, I pushed too hard. Mm. So it's like. Right. No, I'm going to stop this now because this is too much. <laughs> too much. <laughs> Halloween stuff there. Guys, we are in TK Maxx. Are you ready, Ash? We love coming in here, having a look around. The home stuff and the beauty stuff, they do some really good discounts in here as well, so. Do you know what, I was watching a video, I can't remember who it was, the American um, person, and she did a Beverly Hills TK Maxx, and in their TK Maxx, they had all designer stuff in there once. What, like bags? I feel like they do in some London ones, don't they? have a look I'll let you know if we find something interesting or good fun let's have a look mm. that smells very Christmassy to me a spice apple we found the Halloween section so we're just having a, a little look through it how cute is this bowl <laughs> what that's so Aww. cute this brand I've got candles from them they're really good what does it smell like? I don't know. Let me I smell don't like that one. Oh, cinnamon. Yeah, I'm not a cinnamon. Well, it's not really like, I don't know. I, I imagined it to be a bit. What's this one? It's my bottle. This is not part of the decor. <laughs> I want to get like orange. a really nice um, festive cup. Do you know what I mean? Like a nice yeah. mug. Let's do it. I like that. That is cute. Oh, imagine some like. Snacks and stuff yeah. in it. Yeah, popcorn, watching like a scary movie. That is that cute. Is nice, okay, that. that's probably the best thing. Fourteen ninety nine. Fourteen ninety nine. So that and that stand out to me. Guys, they've got a Christmas aisle. What the hell? We've not even had Halloween yet. Nice. And there's already some Christmas this stuff. So to be honest, I'm not. That is. Oh my god, that is so cute. I really like that actually. Look at it. That is really cute, and it's only three pounds. Oh my god, that's actually really cheap. And that. Yeah, that's nice as well. God, it's getting me excited for Christmas. Um, okay, let's just enjoy Halloween. Though. I know. Look <laughs> all these baubles. What's everyone doing with their trees this year? I think I'm just going to go the same kind of theme yeah. as I always do. So like silvery, oh well, God. creams. I shall add, the, I don't know why, these just remind me of when we were younger. They remind me too. I think they remind Cinderella me of Nan's. Story. Cinderella story. Cinderella <laughs> story. In, in the beginning. Aww. Cute. I actually like these. Yeah, I do, you know. old school. Yeah. I like that though. God, look at that. And that. Do you know what, I think when Mila and this baby is older, I really will take Christmas, like, to the extreme. Me too, yeah. <laughs> Mood. Like That's good. Reduced to five pound. Nice decor, isn't it? You made my day. And you just, like, used the bottom. Nice. To light it. I bet that smells nice. Coconut and lime blossom. Oh, that actually does. Let me smell. It smells really nice. It smells really fresh. It smells yeah, clean. That'd be nice in a bathroom. That would be. Oh, I don't know about that. I've really broken the No, I'm more of a cookie. Let me see. Like a cookie scent. I like that. What, you don't like that? Cinnamon, Cinnamon and vanilla. No. No? No. Smell that. Yeah, that one's a bit too strong for me. Let me Apple, see one that I think I would like. 
I think it's more the Christmas scents because it's more of like the... Uh, no, they're just as strong to be honest. Yeah, I mean mum loves anything cinnamon, doesn't she? This one says, killing it. Oh, that smells nice. You'd oh, probably... I bet you like this. No. Yeah, that's nice. Oh, that's yeah. really nice. It's very fresh. It's snowy. Hmm. It's Yankee. Did you see that look? Killing it. <laughs> that is. Hold on, I'm going to have a little look. What? In that one. Hello, four. Oh, that's cute. Yeah, I like that. Oh, I don't like the smell. Why? I don't know. Too strong? I saw a pumpkin. Yeah. This pumpkin. Oh, that's cute. That's so annoying. What does that smell like? Oh, do you think you'll like that? Smell that one. That's a bit more creamy. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. Just creamy. Vanilla How much is that? That's nice. It doesn't say. Oh, it does. It's 25. It smells lovely. Oh, and it would last you ages. For me, the pink's a bit pink, but I like yeah. it. If it was nude. <laughs> oh, there's a green one. Wait, wait, here, look. Look, there's a green one. This one's nice. This would suit my living room really nice. I've got a lot of, like, green really? in my living room. Okay, we're not going to let you smell them. I'm, yeah, I'm clearly not into a lot of scents. Okay, I'm going to smell the green one. So cute. Midnight pumpkin. Nice. Oh, that is beautiful. That smells like... <sighs> that smells so nice. That reminds me of like Halloween. Toffee. Toffee. That's what it sounds like. Yeah, Toffee you're right. Vanilla. That is very nice. Mm. You tempted. <laughs> Kind of. That looks nice. nice on my table. Oh, is it the oh, same? That's that's the best one. So I want a smaller one that just says like full, like, or like that's Hello Four. Yeah, but like, a, like you know, like a skinny one. Do you know what I mean? No. Oh, what about that chocolate pumpkin? Where's that? And sea salt. That looks so pretty. And I've got sweet apple. I can't tell by your face. <laughs> 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 Oh, this smells amazing. Mm. <laughs> I feel like every time I, I see people smelling um, the candles oh, and stuff, they're all like, wow, I love a yeah. bin. You're like, no. Oh, that's so annoying. There is a lot, to be fair. There is a lot to choose from. But Pumpkin butter. Okay, that sounds like a bit of us. That looks nice. No. This one just says Halloween. Halloween. I mean, that smells like a really nice man. Was that come out the shower? Oh yeah, that is nice. Oh, that's, yeah, that's quite it's nice. Like this fresh. one. Yeah, it smells like a guy's just had a shower. Mm. Is there any toffee caramel latte? That sounds nice. It's got like a pumpkin. No. God, you can smell this as soon as you look. Watch. Come in. Wow. I just got a whiff. It smells like coffee. Your yeah. favourite smells like a last latte. latte. Mm. If you're a coffee fan. Look at that one. That's cute. That's alright. I think the best one that I've smelled is the green one. Yeah, the big one. The big green. The big the green one and the pink one. Did you smell it? No. Look. Last one then. Oh, that's not too bad, actually. It smells like caramel. Smell that one. It smells like caramel. That's nice. That is nice. Oh, that is mm. nice. How cute are these little pumpkins? Glittery. What? It's a very random choice of a gift bag. I mean, it's different. What is it? A bird or a plane? Will I be getting them? Or will I be getting... There's no baby girl. <laughs> or baby girls, we shall see. This is pretty. Uh, I like this. Actually, this yeah. is really pretty. Like a nice spring birthday. Yeah, that is. This section is my favourite section. Yeah, you, you know to what, be fair, so every time I come to your house, you have so many throws everywhere. This one's really nice. It's £40. Look at that. So nice. So full. Oh, I like that one. 
They have lots of choices. Oh, so look, look. they've got Christmas well. ones. Aww. Look at that one. It's gone. Oh. And they feel so nice. These would look perfect on my pillow. They're like, so there's so three. Oh, look. Oh, it's a oh. different shade. Is it? Is it? Yeah, it's a little bit lighter. Oh, I like these. These would be perfect on my sofa. Ten pounds? No, they're not. This one's twelve, and that oh. one's thirteen. Sorry, I looked at that, and it said ten. So. What's your thirteen? Thirteen. Twelve. Hmm. Why is this one one pound cheaper? It's random. They're so nice, though. These would be perfect on my um, sofa. I wanted to add some brown into my sofa because I've got white. It's quite creamy, isn't it? Yeah. I'm tempted. <laughs> Sorry, but why am I so satisfied by this? That cut on wall bun? Yeah. That is so cute. Six pounds. Oh, I like that. That would suit my bathroom, that would. That would. Aw. So if I'm still thinking about these pillows, I'm coming back to buy these. I also like this one. Six quid. That is Oh, it's a pool. Yeah. Is there a few? There as well. Ow. We were saying that we like this as well. The little um, blankets basket or like toy basket. I like these. Okay, well, we know okay. they're here. If you want to come back. Nice. What would you use it for? I don't know. Probably in my bathroom. So I like how. Yeah, quite, yeah. It's narrow. Quite narrow, yeah. I like that. I like the cotton wool buds. <laughs> buds, balls. Most of my baskets are from here. I get, my, I get mine from Primark. Oh, I get mine. Oh, I, need, I actually need has some mom more. Has mum got that? Yes, I think she, she does. She puts her onions in that, innit? Do you like know what? That's so, such a good idea for like your veg and stuff. That'd be good for like... Oh, it's double. Oh, even better. Mum would love that. Mum, TK Maxx, Norwich Eight store. <laughs> we are in the Norwich store, by the way. <laughs> Okay, so next up we have the White Company. It smells so good in here. It really does. Seychelles is normally my go-to. Yeah, Seychelles is good, isn't it? Scent. But there's Fireside Winter Autumn that we're gonna smell. I think that's it. I wanna oh smell that. Oh, Fireside does literally smell like a fireside. Does it? Yeah. Doesn't it smell like a fireside? It's a bit smoky. Yeah, that's what I mean. Oh, I don't like know how it's a well. very strong, overpowering. Yeah, very but pomegranate is nice. You just smell winter. That actually smells like winter. Does it? Like the leaves and like. Yeah, it really does. Oh my god, that's so it's bizarre. Weird. Like, yeah, it made yeah, me yeah. Smile it actually made me think of winter. I think I like this scent. Where is what was missing? Autumn, where's Wild rhubarb. Ooh. It's a fireside though. It's literally fireside fire. is literally a fireside. It's fire, like a fire. Yeah. It's too strong, I think. I want to look at the baby stuff while we're in here. So, the spa stuff is so nice in here. This is where me and I should get the girls' blankets from. Don't we? Because obviously the girls. She's so cute. Mila just walks around with it in her hand like Yeah, she, she does. It's so cute. And then when I get her out of the cot, she goes. Blanket. Like, well, yeah, blanket. she'll be like, blanket. She'll be like this. Yeah. No, yeah, I got that tip from Aish. Because it's really good to just like have a really good blanket, especially when they're going to use it every day as well. Yeah. So Aisha has the grey and the white one, and I have the. The grey and the brown. Oh, the grey and the brown. Her favorite. Yeah. And I have the brown and the white. We'll show you when we go upstairs. Look at these leaves, very autumn, winter. Nice little piece to add to the oh, house, I think. Like yeah, that's autumn, that's winter. Oh, I should look at the um, the door reef. Oh, yeah, the door reef. That's so cute. I thought you said the dory. It's like, where's the door reef? The <laughs> you shouldn't touch the yeah, sides. Oh my god, my favourite section in the White Company. The kids wear. Oh my god, so cute. <laughs> Wait, should we show them the blankets? Oh, poorly little. Yeah, and that one. 
This is the one we both have. That's why Aisha has in there. There should be a white one somewhere. Down there, I've got the white ones. Too. Not that one, it's that in white, isn't oh, it? Yeah. Oh, it's so nice. This. Yeah. Oh. I don't know who bought me it. I can't remember if I bought it. I was very luckily gifted a lot of stuff, so... I can't remember. This is so cute. Oh, I like this one. This one's perfect for a little boy. I don't know, just either. I think the white company is, like, a nice place to come for, like, gift giving. Yeah, I agree. I think it's just easy because they have so many cute things. And all at different prices. Some things are so affordable, you know, mm. actually. Cute. £28. Cute. Look, Celia, welcome to the world book. That is Aww. cute. Oh, they have the, the nappy... What are they called? Nappy caddies? I forgot what they're called, cool, but they're very um, useful. I have one of them. Here. For her winter oh, blanket. So nice. I'm getting this from here for a winter blanket. Yeah. Why don't you sign them? Get matching. Come on. Matching? Oh. Cute. Oh. That's such a cute gift. And this is fourteen pounds. Mila has. I got my towels in here as well. Yeah, same. Mila has this hanging on her bedroom door. How cute is this? <laughs> Look, such a pretty blanket. Thirty-six pounds. This is such a good idea as a gift or just to buy yourself. Water bottle. Oh, love a water bottle, especially in the winter time. How much is it in here? Thirty-two pounds. Oh, sorry, thirty-five. I got one from Primark, four pounds. Just the same thing. Exactly. How pretty is that? That is stunning. So cute. We're gonna have a quick look in next home now. Uh oh, it's next to the kids. Uh oh, it's next to the kids. <laughs> We've just popped into next. How cute are these little mugs? Our family pumpkin patch, our family pumpkin patch. So cute, so nice. I was just looking at these, literally everything in here is so pretty. I just love and it. And this. Yeah, I was just saying to Ash, they have a big one, but then they also have two mini ones here. These would be perfect for like little like dinners or like oats or something. Oh, I like them. And then show them that. <laughs> How cute. Oh, it's hand painted. That's so cute. Oh. That is so cute. I actually really like that. It's only five pounds. Which, please. Look at that. It's a toilet roll cover. No. <laughs> oh. Oh. Get it? God, Christmas stuff. Can't believe it. The scent of Christmas. Christmas. Smell that. Very festive. Oh wow, look at that. Oh my god, it's getting me excited. It's literally getting me so excited. Oh, is it different letters? Oh, it's Pia's first Christmas. Oh, that's so cute. You should, I got Mila a bauble and it said Mila's first Christmas. And yeah. I've got it. You should get Okay, I will. Uh, where do I get it from? Etsy, maybe? Or okay. it's online, I'll find it. Oh my god, look. Little wax melts. Gingerbread. I'm too excited. I'm literally too excited for Christmas. Okay, we are now walking towards B&M. We're going to have a little look in here to see what they've got in. And oh, I, I want to go and look in Matalan as well. Matalan is next door as well, so we're going to check H &M. out Matalan, maybe H&M. We'll see. Right, we've just come down the cleaning aisle. This B&M, since from when I used to live in Norwich. Sorry. extended it. What? It was so hot. They've extended it. Oh, every time I keep looking at myself, I see this this one in particular standing out to me. Please, it literally making fine. me feel quite insecure. I'm not gonna lie. They've extended it. It's massive in here. We're looking. We're looking down the um, cleaning aisle first. See what they've got in down here. The most exciting thing from here: some sponges. Some sponges. But I've seen that they've got all like the Christmassy um, frosted berries. Exactly. I want to smell them. Oh, that's shout out. Mm. Mm. That smells amazing. Do you know what this reminds me of? What does it remind you of? Go on. Reminds me of, this reminds me of our, our old, old house. house when we lived together. 
I love that. That, that smells, smells amazing. I might have to get that. Or is it too early? Is it? No. What is I'm sorry. Sugar that delight. is going to smell amazing. I bet that one's going to be more me. Or not. <laughs> yeah, a bit more yay. <laughs> or not. No, that sugar one that was one lovely. so good. Wait, was there any other ones? This is... I love, like, Lenore, like... Actually, I think oh, I'll yeah, that. The frosted berries is definitely the best one. Just seen another Christmas item. So this is the foam um, fresheners, like the ones you spray onto the carpet. And I would normally just hoover over it, even though it says no need to vacuum. I just think it smells nice and it's fresher. But, oh my God. What is, is the it scent? Autumn, Wait, what's the scent of this one? It doesn't say, I just saw Christmas and it just got me excited. They've got that one as well. What's that? Yeah, but where are the scents? Doesn't say, oh, spiced apple. That's spiced apple. That's like this time of year. Where did you see that? Here. Fairy oh, dust. Fairy dust. That proper smells nice. And then and that's, perfect oh, Christmas, Christmas tree. tree. I ah. bet it smells like a Christmas proper tree. Christmas yeah. tree. You know what? I might get a flash mop. Oh, I've got one. Yeah, the one. They're just quite easy. easy. Quite handy. I got this as well. For the we use this, I love it. We've spilt so much on our carpet, we use this, come straight out. And on our sofa, probably not this. Probably not meant to. On my toilet. I love the way that that foams, it, it's really satisfying, the way that it just foams up your toilet. Mm -hmm. you'll, you'll know what I mean when you use it. The two separate ones? Yeah, or is there so a ginger this is bread? a gingerbread oh, yeah. and that's a tree. These are so cute, with like a little tea light inside. And they're three pounds. I actually cute. like these lamps. I'd like it if the wood was slightly lighter, I think. Oh my god, Christmas aisle, <gasps> we can't even find the um, Halloween aisle and we found the Christmas aisle, <gasps> that is crazy, it honestly is getting me so, so excited, oh my god this is such nice wrapping paper, wait a minute, you're a bit low but how nice is this wrapping paper, what does it say, oh, oh that is cute, how nice is that? And this one, if you're going for that theme. I like this one. Oh yeah, I feel like you always go for that kind of colour. Yeah. Blue. I, don't I, I don't like know blue what theme to go time. for. These are so nice. Very filled baubles. Cute. Very festive. I like the green as well. Just I share no, that's a bit of me. I found all of the best. Right, you take the one you like. I, I like this yeah. one. And it's actually really light. And I like it's this ten, one. It's 10 meters. Look right. at that. Mind your face. Oh, oh that one. Look at that. And then I like this one. Oh, we're getting so excited for Christmas and it's Oh my god, it's £1.50. Do I get it? That's quite quite a lot. Are you quite a lot? No, as in like like a lot. For how of much? Meters. Reckon, there's, yeah, no, there's right. a lot of meters, look. I like the theme. Actually, I like this. I think I want this to be my theme. I love this one as well. I mean, Aisha, we're literally like... No, but come on, I know someone watching this is going to be just as excited as us. <gasps> Luxury. I Christmas. wish... Oh, why is it I not would Christmas love to yet? have posted. <gasps> that goes with your wrapping paper. <laughs> and that one goes with mine. Don't, there they are. Am I silly? Do I just pick the... Come on, do I? I think you're, it's too early. Guys, we're in silly, September. Silly, but this is gonna go. Look how pretty Get it, it then, get it. Get it. £1.50 for 10 metres, that's really good. That's like amazing. And I like the green. Yeah, Maybe see, I'm, I'm gonna do this, I think. Yeah, but or I do like this green. Don't you think you should get it now? No. Can you get it now as well? Why? Because we, we, I don't feel like I'm doing it. Well. Where am I gonna store it? In your house? Under my bed. Come on, let's do it together. No, because I feel like I'd need to get loads. So it's 10 metres as well. Yeah, but for so everyone's don't... wrapping, so I'm yeah. not going to get four. No, now. but like for like your little family as well, it'd look cute. No. <laughs> it's too early, it's September. What about two of them? <laughs> it's September, you get it. Oh, I should look at this though. Then what? But then, no. Oh, no, you no, don't no. have to have all the same. No, I don't. Because like with true. this, it would look really nice with like a sage wrapping. Do you really like want me to get more? Yeah, I'm now. gonna get two now. Zelia's gonna get two now as well. <laughs> All right.
Oh, I actually want to get I'm these. I'm pressured into this. I'm stopping myself from getting these. How much okay, are these? I'll get two of these. How much? I told myself I'm not going to spend money and I'm just spending money already. So I'm buying wrapping paper in September. <sighs> Oh You're thankful for this. Just... Aisha's getting all excited. She's just seen something else she wants. I'm, I'm oh, these are cute. Oh, oh no. Right, okay, this vlog is going to be called Christmas in September. <laughs> oh my god. I've just seen this and I'm, I'm in love. Oh, I like that. I like this. I love the green. Aisha, I actually like this. This is the one that I was this showing you, I and I this want. feels really nice. See, I'm, I'll be honest, I'm not keen. I'm keen and I'm keen. No, but let me just tell you, this is on its own over there. I showed you that. You didn't? I did. I said, look how cute this is. Oh, no, it's a, it's a green version. It's a green version. Okay, I should stop. She's getting too excited. She's going to find a basket. Oh. That matches my theme perfectly. I'm going to get them, they're a pound. Okay, get them. <laughs> Here, this is what you wanted. Yeah, but it's not sagey green. That is, that's not. I wish I could just buy that on its own. Aish, look. Oh, it's my theme. All right, you've got your theme now, haven't you? Then you're going to come back and it's going to be all gone. You're going to get it? Get it? I'll get this. I need some, like, sagey... W I'm going for that vibe. Do you get... Yeah, so I think we're going similar but different because Aisha's going for. Yeah, but do you know what I'm thinking? This. Will Mila like this? Why don't you do that for family? Family and. I think for me, um, like Mila, maybe do different. I'm going to do that for family. That's... So should we just get one then because it's 10 meters or do we still get two? It's up to you. What are you getting? Whatever you want me to get. No. Because you're pressuring me into buying wrapping paper but in we'll September. Yeah? No, two. Just so we have Because there's matching, just in yeah. case. Yeah, let's do that. I'll get them so I can put this together. We need a basket. Okay, I'm going to show these to Aisha and you watch how excited she gets. Because this is her theme. Am I going overboard now? I don't know. You've got your... You're, you're, <laughs> now you're going to leave here and the whole thing. No, I like them. Because this could go with the sage wrapping paper that I'm going to find. Yeah. And then this. I don't like the green of this, but I like the green of this. Might look nice with that. Yeah, I think it will. Look, well, maybe both I'll of leave our these. wrapping papers are very similar. I know. Um, I do like that though. I like that whole set. Like I'm now starting to think should I just buy that instead? Right, so we have found the Halloween aisle, but do you know what? I do. Do you remember when we used to go when we was young a lot? We always like dress I always dress up as a um you a always, witch. Yeah, always. Ah, oh, they're nice. They are actually, aren't they? That's really cute. It's your aesthetic. It is my aesthetic. Age. No price on it though. The big one's five pounds. Little orange ones. Mmm, I really wanted a mug. Oh my god, that's Halloween so cute for Halloween stuff. That's you. Yeah. That's very you. They're cute. Where, Celia is a well, massive where are these from then? That makes me think there's another island. Hi guys, so we are actually home now and we are both absolutely shattered. Um, Zelia actually is sitting with the bowl and hot water for her foot, her toe, shall I say. I don't know if you guys remember in the beginning of this video she mentioned um, her toe is very infected. So She's currently sitting over there struggling bless her but yeah we're now home we really hope you guys enjoyed this video you can hear coco melon on in the background the girls are both watching it and yeah gonna have some dinner shortly and then i probably am heading off but zelly is coming to mine in two days time so we'll be seeing her again soon i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please smash it a big thumbs up and we'll see you guys in our next one thanks for watching bye bye <laughs> bye